Good morning, friends. Welcome back to the channel. It's Malzi here. Um, so we're back here at the project we've been working on. This is Scott's house. This was the huge remodel that we had to do. And I just learned something yesterday. You can actually take the trash out of there. Um, so if you remember when we started this project, this house was full of trash. And so I recycled it all. And I was able to, and I did a few jobs, and I was able to upgrade my trash compactor back at my office, which compacts the trash into now, it contracts it into like these huge cubes instead of the boxes. Or instead of like smaller cubes, they're huge. And you get a hell of a lot of money for them when you sell them to the recycling plant. I had enough, I made over $200,000 just from the recyclables from this job. That's how much trash and recyclable stuff there was. Um, I'll have to show you that in another video. But um, but we're done with this. I finished it, but as promised, I waited to complete the job before I s finished it. Or I waited for you guys before I finished it. So this is the front porch. This is the living room. You'll see every room is 100%, except for the bathrooms. I don't know what else they want in the bathroom. So here's the hall tree that I chose. Here's the kitchen. And I know I said I was going to do um, like more furniture, but here's some things that I learned. It doesn't matter. Here's the guest bedroom. I don't know if we can sleep. Oh, we can. still going to be dark outside though. Anyway, mm. here's the guest bedroom. Wait, why is it? <coughs> I, I put everything in here that it wanted. I had this room at 100%, so I don't know. We're just still going to do the finish the job. I'm not doing anything else. Here is the downstairs bathroom. Oh, and now it's saying 100%. See, and uh, before, it didn't like the cabinet I put in here. I don't know. It's weird. Anyhow, <coughs> here is the upstairs. The hallways are completely done. You can see there. This is the other bathroom. And here's the, like, the, the throne room, if you will. Here is the game room. <coughs> Where's the light? Here's the game room. Here is, oh, sorry, here's the office. And I know, <coughs> sorry about that. I know it's very plain and very like, not very well decorated, but a few things I learned while doing this job don't put anything in here that they don't ask for. Because if you do, um, if you do, it actually kind of takes points away. So I only put in the things that it asked for and the luxury points that it asked for. And then for the optional rooms, so here's the entire house. And then for the optional rooms, don't waste your money on super fancy stuff because it's not going to matter. It doesn't matter in the long run. You're not going to get any more or less money by using higher or lower, de lower quality um, furniture, only in the optional things. So if it's required for the mission, of course, buy the luxury point that it says. Don't buy higher and don't buy lower because it won't count. <laughs> so if we're going to look at our tablet, let's look at our mission. And for Scott, so our original bid, what he was going to pay us, was $75,000. Okay. We're completely done. Have we picked up all of our trash? Yeah. So now, because it says we're 97%, and I think it's because the guest bedroom isn't registering, but look how much we're going to get paid. So we have, like, almost quadrupled our money just by doing 
all of the extra assignments, all of the extra stuff that's not required for the mission. And we're going to go ahead and finish this. And we're getting $367,000. I'm going to go over here to my... Oh. I have a build job now. Build for Ivan. He wants three floors. We're going to start this mission later. We're not going to do this right now. He wants someone to help him build a home because he's going to become, instead of a pilot, he's going to become a flight instructor. So that's pretty cool. Um, yes, we're and he's going to pay us, if we do only the, the required stuff, he's going to pay us $200,000. But for now, we're not going to start that right now. This is going to be kind of a short video um, today because... Um, Because um, <coughs> we had some additions to our family this weekend. We have two new babies of the furry persuasion. We have two puppies. Um, they are eight weeks old. Two puppy puppies. They're Frenchton puppies, and they are so stinking cute. So if you're wondering what is a Frenchton puppy, a Frenchton puppy is a mix of French Bulldog and Boston Terrier. So Hubby has been wanting a French Bulldog for a while. And my mission is, oh, it's right there. Oh, wow, it looks like, it's, oh, it's right here, okay. So this is Ivan's house. We can go ahead and plan this property. But that's all we're going to do right now. He wants three, he wants a huge house. Holy cow. Okay. So the house size, okay, 2,000 meters squared. He wants a mansion. Okay. Um, I gotta figure out, like, how many square feet, oh, I'm not paying for an app. Okay, so 2,000 at the minimum is 21,000 square foot home. He wants a 21,000 square foot home. Holy cow. Okay, so he wants a huge, see, he wants, okay, so he wants a 250 square foot He wants a 2,600 square foot living room. Holy cow. Okay, so. And he wants, okay, so we need a living room, a kitchen, a bathroom, guest room, and then another bathroom. But he wants three floors. I am not understanding this. He doesn't even want like a master bedroom. That's weird. Okay, well, we're going to start with the floor. Oops. So 900 meters squared. That's 9,600 square feet right there. That is a humongous house. Okay. Well, and, and I don't want to do a big box. So let's do... 
let's erase like Let's make it kind of like this. And let's do... Dang it. Eight point two five. This is not equal. Okay. Wait a minute. Okay. First of all, let's figure out <coughs> how how wide this is. Thirty meters. Okay, so, whoops. What I want is 15 meters here. Or no, I want 10. Damn it. Okay, this is not easy. That's what I want. Okay, that's what I want. <coughs> and then what we're going to do is we're going to go, let's go 10 meters in. Actually, that feels like it's too big. We'll go 5. So here's our, like, entryway. So we're going to get rid of this. Get rid of that. So here's going to be our entryway. We'll make this a bathroom. So this is going to be a bathroom. We'll make this a bathroom, and then this will be a laundry room. Okay, so that's the laundry room. And then I think over here... What else does he want? So let me think. Let's go with the kitchen. We'll put the kitchen here, or no, you know what? We'll 
We'll put the guest room over here. So this will be the guest room. Um, let's put the stairs right here. Let's do a U shape stair. And so this right here will be the hallway. And then all of this is going to be open. We're going to have kitchen, dining room, and living room. So let's do our kitchen. Let's put our kitchen right there. Let's find our dining room. Our living room is going to be all of this. And then this will be the dining room. Okay, they need to fix this planner and make it not so dang difficult to use. Okay, so now we're going to put in our exterior walls, the rest of our exterior walls. Maybe. It needs to not erase <coughs> if you make a mistake with the mouse. Yeah, seriously, who can keep their mouse perfectly steady? Certainly not me. Damn it, this is really annoying. There we go. After we get the house planned, then we'll go ahead and I'll I'll take you back to the office and I'll show you around the place because oh, because oh, there we go. Okay, <clears throat> now let's put our stairs back. So all this will be hallway. <coughs> Sorry about that. Okay. So even with all this stuff, this house still isn't big enough, but it's okay. Um, all right. So we're going to, let's put in our doors, our interior door.
We need an interior wall right here. Actually, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to make the bathroom just a tiny bit smaller. Oh, we need a floor right there. Okay, we're going to put this as a hallway now. I wish I could just like leave that open. You know what? I think I can. Okay, so we're going to make the laundry room a little bit bigger. There we go. And that's a hallway, and then we just need an interior door here. And then I want to erase this right here. And we'll put a floor right there. Yeah, so this is the bathroom, laundry room, guest room. Okay, so here is our downstairs. And then now we need an exterior door. I want a double door. That look about centered? It does to me. And then let's put two long windows here. Okay. And then let's put two long windows here. Can't really put two long windows here because that's a bathroom. I mean, I guess we could. Why not? Let's do it. We'll put a long window there. And one there. And then what I want to do down here is I want to bring in lots and lots and lots of natural light.
Okay. And then we'll put a double door here. I think that's lined up. If it's not, oh well. Let's put some triple windows in. And then we'll do a couple triple windows in the kitchen. We'll do a couple windows here in the guest room. There. Okay, so I think that's pretty good for the first floor. Huge living room. Okay, first floor. Okay, um, and all he wants is another bathroom, but we're going to give him way more than that. Okay, we're going to go ahead and This is going to be the upstairs bathroom. And then <coughs> we need a wall here. Whoops. Um Okay, so I'm thinking maybe an office right here. Okay, so there's the office. The master bedroom is going to be pretty much like way this way. Actually, we'll make that a dressing room. We'll put a TV room and a music room upstairs. A TV room, game room, and music room upstairs on the third level. And then this is going to be the master bathroom. Okay, so we need our interior walls here. We can make the, we'll take away a little bit from the bedroom. Okay. 
Okay. And then we can make this actually another bedroom. Okay, so that's another bedroom. Um, and then all of this, I guess, will just be hallway. This can be a storage room. We need an interior wall there. Yeah, this will be a hallway. Okay. So that's the second floor. And the third floor, we're just going to leave it like really open. We're just going to designate areas. The first thing we need is some stairs. Wait, why is it letting me? Make this a library. Put a game room here. Why isn't it letting me do stairs? I don't know why it's not letting me do stairs. I need another stair. Do I need to put another set of stairs in? We'll do that. There we okay, there we go. So it's kind of like in the middle of the room. So we're just gonna designate like areas. Okay, and this can be the gym. We'll put a gym up here too. And oh, we'll do interiors. Okay, so let's do this will be a music room. And then a TV room. It's a huge TV room. And we'll actually, actually, we'll make this part the hallway. <coughs> okay, so now we need... I 
Actually, we need to bring this game room out just a little bit more. The music room can be open, though. And then I'm thinking too, instead of this part being TV room, we'll, we'll have like two libraries. Or maybe, <coughs> let's do a bathroom up here too. Okay, so now we need doors. So the gate, the gym, or the game room door is going to be here. The bathroom door is going to be here. And the gym door is going to be here. <laughs> okay, so we need windows. There we go. Okay. And again, we want to bring in lots of natural light. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. I have to stop here in a few minutes. And I like the long windows. Let's do triple windows. We'll do a triple window here, one here, 
one here and one here. Okay, so that whole room has doors. So we need to put our windows and doors in here. Okay, so interior door, we're going to put it right there. Guess I'll put that one there. So that's all of our bedroom doors. Okay, windows. We don't want any other long windows in here. Okay. Um. That's for the bed. same here the bed will go here this is a huge bedroom oh my goodness okay it's way too excessive in my opinion I think that'll be good. Okay. All right. So let's check. Room is too small. What are you talking about? What well, room is too small? Oh, it must be this one. Okay, well, that's okay. We'll just make that part of the living room. I know it's not these. I know it's not that. Okay, so it's got to be this.
There we go. What room is too small? What is it talking about? There's no rooms that are too small now. Okay. <clears throat> under the size of four meter square. Nothing is under the size of four meter square. I don't, I don't understand. I'm not seeing it. Where is it too small? Nothing is too small. 12 meters, 12 meters. On this one? I don't know what it's talking about, and if I click out of this, it's going to make me start all over. Like if I exit... So it's something on this one. Okay, the only thing I can think of is maybe if the storage room is too small. Or if the dressing room is too small.
I have no idea what it wants. And it's going to make me do this whole dance. There's something on this level that's too small. But I've met all the requirements in all the floors, so I don't know what it's talking about. I don't know. I have no idea. I have no idea, and if I click out of this, it's not going to save it. But we'll see. I'm going to exit planning now. Oh, okay, I can load the plan. Okay, you know what? I don't have time for this right now. Ugh, I hope I can. Let me see. Does it really work? Loading plan? Load the plan. Okay, so, all right, cool. I'll have to come back and refigure this because I don't have time to do this right now. I wanted to show you... I have a few more minutes. So this is where the mission is. I wanted to show you my office. And if you played this game, you probably have seen it. But I'm going to take you there anyway. So I'm going to take you there and just kind of show you around. And unfortunately, I don't think I have any trash to show you the trash compactor. But that's okay. I hate when people are on this exit ramp with me, or on ramp with me. This is too small. Get out the way! Oh, I was... <laughs> yesterday... Um, my son decided to play this game with me. And so we played for a couple hours. I know that's not a really long time, but... Um, so he and I were playing. We started a new, a new game. But... Um, But um, it was, it's actually really fun, and it's way better with two people. <laughs> so we're not going to use the proper entrance into the office because it's a pain in the butt. We're going to do this way. We're going to go, because that's the whole compound right there. So here is the office, and I've done a lot to it, actually. I'll take you on a grand tour of what I've done. So this is my home. I have not built the garage yet because I don't feel the need for a garage when I only have one vehicle. This is where you like upgrade things. Oh wow, look, I didn't know you could do that. So the office is maxed out, the garbage, oh the garage, trash compactor is maxed out. 
office decorations. I've bought the coffee corner, the skate park, the small trees, the large trees in the pergola, um, the office lights, the artificial grass, and the corner cafe. That's all bought. Storage. I could upgrade, but I don't want to right now. Fuel is already maxed out. Power, this is what I do need. Um, I could put solar panels on there. Battery level 2? Yeah, I don't want to spend that much money right now. But I think I will put solar panels on there. Okay, so I've upgraded some power. The office solar panel, that's what I really want. But I don't want to spend that much money because I'm going to need it to build that huge ass house. Okay, office gate. I don't really feel the need. I mean, I guess I could. We'll go ahead and buy that. Just to make it better. Okay, the pool I already did. The garden I did not do. We can, we, you know what? We can go ahead and do that one as well. Didn't do the garden. Road and navigation. Oh, wait. Trees. Garden lights, wooden house. You know what? We'll go ahead and buy all of this too and upgrade this. Okay. That's all we're going to need to, we're, we're going to be able to do. Okay. I did not buy the navigation thing yet and I did not buy the basketball court. Which actually... Mm, I don't think I want to do that just yet. I don't want to spend any more money, but that's how you upgrade things. So here's the garden that we just upgraded. Look how nice it looks. A nice picnic area. Oh, I saw this in one of the houses that I was working on. And here's the pool area. It's completely upgraded. This is where I Got the pool toys and the water and not that you can use any of this stuff. Well it looks like a fire pit, barbecue area, music area and a bar. Um since I don't have a house, I kinda made one here. So I mean it's open, there's no privacy, but just me. So got a kitchen, a dining area, a washer, living room, office desk and a bedroom area and that's it and then if you come over here there's um I bought the patio furniture here and then here's different offices too there's nothing in them but they're there and then So that's that part, and then over here, I guess, is where the, s the basketball court goes. Oh, let me put, let me take the trash. I did not know you could take the trash. Oh, look. Oh, 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 let me go get the van. I'm going to show you something cool. We're going to stick the trash in the van real quick. We have three boxes of paper.
I bet you if I do some of these go green missions that are volunteer, I'll get a lot of trash. And the demolition jobs give you a lot of trash. So, let's check this out. Let's go down here to the trash compactor. So that's another garden right there. I've got one wind turbine. And you guys know me. I have to have the coffee. So there's a little coffee cafe right there. This is a trash center. This is the trash compactor. So you see there's nothing in here right now. But if we take... Actually, they're back here. If we turn it on... Oh, well, let me go make sure there's power to it. You have to put power to everything. So here is the powerhouse, and there is tr power to the trash compactor. I've got 11,000 watts coming in and stored in the batteries. You can see they're full. So we have trash there. All right, power to the compactor. So we're going to turn it on. And then check this out. We're not going to do the black bag. We're going to leave that in alone. <coughs> see, when it has enough, you can see right there. So the paper, when it has enough to fill it, it'll spit out a block of paper. See how it's put out the block of paper? We're going to store this for right now. Okay. So it doesn't have enough right now. Because we don't have enough trash. But then you take that to the recycling center and you get a lot of money. Actually, quite a bit of money for it. We're going to turn that off. So the next time that I have enough, I'll show you. Put the black bags over here. And I have them labeled, you know, glass, paper. You get a lot of paper. Metal and then plastic. And then there's extra storage over there. Now the last thing I wanted to show you is oh and if we come over here we've got our fuel station Close this. we don't really need this generator anymore and it it uses a lot of gas but if you click on this you can have your your gas delivered and you can see i've only used a little bit so now i don't really have to pay for gas too much i mean it costs i think three thousand to fill each one so for six but it lasts a really long time like I only filled it one time and that's all that I've used and then over here is the storage area the storage unit and you can see I've got some extra plaster and some extra stuff we're gonna go ahead and Put this extra stuff here. Until I need it. The kind of sucky part though is that you can only sh have like one, you can only carry one gas can at a time. But after I unload this, I gotta go. I get ready for work. I gotta let the puppies outside to go potty. Clean up their little area here. This is all the white paint. I have bought way too much plaster. You know what? I'm gonna sell that. That's not even enough to do anything with. And that too. Yeah, here's some 
flooring. Scaffolding I'm going to hang on to. Oh, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and put my, buy my generator, put it here. Because I'm going to need it at the other job site. Oh, and you can also take out loans, which I did for a few things. Um, so if you go into the company and you go into the bank, you can see that I, I borrowed 144000 and I paid 61 of it back. So I only owe eighty two grand now, but I'm not going to pay it off. Even though I have the money right now, I'm not going to pay it off just yet. But... Um, that's all I'm going to do for today. I got to go. I got to get ready for work and I got to let the puppies out so they can go potty. And I got to clean up their little, little pen area. They were sleeping. Now they woke up. Let me tell you something. Frenchton puppies drink a lot of water. It's really weird. Never seen any puppy or any dog drink so much water.